When we were young, we always dreamt of um, that dream job, being able to work remotely from home, anytime, any day, uh, at your own terms. Um, but we haven't really taken that plunge because it's not the norm. Mm. Over the last few years, I had the opportunity to work from home two to three times a week, and that was manageable. Yeah. Fast forward to now, you know, we've got the whole family at home, hoping myself and our two little boys, you know, four-year-old, and a six-year-old, and uh, holy moly, you know, is it a challenge? You bet it was a challenge. It's like mixing, you know, a couple of potions in a big cauldron, and they're shouting, abracadabra, you know, then fireworks, boom. You know, it can be both magical and uh, dangerous at the same time. Well, we believe that um, being able to see our kids grow up is mm. the best gift that we could give to each other. We do not want to be the parent that, you know, becomes so busy at work and we end up missing out on them growing up. And with the current situation, you know, we're taking it as a sign and as an opportunity to more or less, you know, work our dream job and using it as a trial period. And by no means have we got it all figured out. It's all about developing systems and processes for what, you know, best for us, what works for us, and to improvise um, along the way. I mean, it is a challenge, but you do what you can, and how you change is how you succeed. We're just going to share with you a few things that has worked for us to date. Mm -hmm. So number one, always um, plan out your work day. So have a schedule, but with healthy boundaries. Yeah, number two, set your designated, you know, remote working area. Now make sure you actually spend the time to get it right because you'll be spending a lot of time there and you want to make sure you know it's comfortable. Number three, co-working can be great. Mm. Just um, let your kids, why not let your kids sit beside you and do some work? But just be prepared to get <laughs> yeah. interrupted. Yeah, number four, set uh, clear rules and boundaries both for yourself and, uh, and your kids. Number five, Always remember to take breaks, mm. even if it's just five or ten minutes here and there. Mm. Number six, um, co get connected to nature. Yeah. Why not bring a laptop out outside and then, you know, work outside in the yard for a few hours. Yep. And like the last, number seven, is be flexible, you know. In these times, these interesting times, I think flexibility and adaptability is, uh, is right up there. So there you go, we're attacking Ho Ping from turn X. We create, innovate, and marry needs to situations. So please follow us on turnx.com, so that's turn-x.com, and our blog. We're also on Facebook, and more recently, YouTube and Instagram. So thanks for listening. Have a wonderful day wherever you are. Safe travels. See ya. Bye. Bye.